What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Critical Overlord here. So this will be the episode 5 recap for The Boys Season 3, Episode 5. Episode 5 starts with Mother's Milk watching footage of someone being tested on and Kamiko is still shown recovering from her injuries. Now the subject that Mother's Milk is, uh, it would appear to be watching is Soldier Boy. Um, and then we see Mother's Milk talking to Butcher about killing gunpowder and reminding him of their thoughts that the suit power shouldn't be had by anyone. We then see Homelander talks to what I will call a board of directors. Edgar seems to have been removed from Vought due to recent revelations. Homelander has the entire board scared of him. Homelander seems to have appointed Deep as head of crime analytics as well. The boys are then shown returning to US to the to the states. Uh, Supersonic's death is presented as a drug overdose. Huey comforts Starlight and reveals he's been taking temporary compound V and Soldier Boy is alive in Russia. He admits he loved the rush and confidence he got from the temporary compound V. Again, this is his arc this season, Huey's arc this season, having strength or feeling weak and finding it in the wrong places. So Soldier Boy, who was being stored, is now roaming free in Russia. Uh, May visits Butcher regarding Soldier Boy's status and delivers more te temporary compound V to him. Maeve starts to kiss Butcher and they ultimately end up having sex. Nina confronts Frenchie about the recent activity in Russia with Soldier Boy while he is visiting Kamiko at the hospital. Soldier Boy attacks seem to have taken her power away, thus making her Ryan, her, her Ryan conversation that she had earlier in the season a form of foreshadowing, I'll call it. So A-Train is meeting with Homelander about Blue Hawk as a thank you for staying loyal. Soldier Boy wanders around and kills a few people in New York after making his way to the States. Mother's Milk goes to see his daughter and tells her to stop watching Homelander because he's a bad influence. Homelander and Starlight talk about finding and stopping Soldier Boy since he has arrived in the States near Vaught. Starlight is trying to track Soldier Boy down through cameras on the streets and learns Deep fired half the analytic team for not being team players. A-Train and Blue Hawk try to stage an apology in a black community, but it turns into an attack, both verbal and physical. This scene probably was my, one of my favorites because it shows how no one wants to talk about the root cause of certain issues. So we then jump to Huey, Butcher, and Mother's Milk going to see Legend about Soldier Boy. He was a VP of Hero Management at Vaught before Steelwell came in. Mother's Milk believes Legend owes him something since he helped cover up his family's murders. Soldier Boy recently visited Legend to pick up his super suit and get his girlfriend's address. This would, of course, be Crimson Countess. Homelander is on the Coleman show and downplays Soldier Boy's threat, false flags, citywide curfews in response. This is a feed that Maeve is watching, but Homelander interrupts to talk about Butcher and her recent affairs. She reveals she always hated Homelander, but then she's attacked from behind. Butcher and Huey take more temporary compound V, but Mother's Milk is still not taking it. Starlight is told that Maeve is on a wellness retreat, which is clearly a lie. Ashley starts to break down to Starlight, but continues to stay loyal out of fear, uh, st staying loyal to Homelander. Countess is shown to be a cam girl, <laughs> but is attacked by Butcher. Uh, she is told that Soldier Boy is alive and coming to see her. Her response is show shows she knew soldier boy was alive so starlight arrives and talks to huey about his about his temporary compound v taking mother's milk is drugged by butcher soldier boy arrives to see countess and is revealed that she betrayed him to the russians all those years ago countess reveals she and her payback members hated soldier boy and then he kills her causing an explosion it is revealed Huey and Butcher plan to team up with Soldier Boy because his abilities show he might be the weapon that can destroy Homelander. Huey tells Starlight he's doing this to protect her from Homelander. And then the episode ends. Now, I thought that this week's episode, I, I got them mixed up. I thought this was going to be the Hero Gasm episode this week, but the Hero Gasm, I guess, is next week <laughs> of episode six. And, you know, episode five, I thought was a very good episode. It definitely gave you not a, a lot of new revelations. Uh, of course, you find out about some of the other things going on between Payback and Soldier Boy and what ended up, I guess, causing what happened to Soldier Boy to happen and how they were kind of conspiring against him, how there was some animosity, how Soldier Boy again was like the original Homelander before Homelander was Homelander. So there's a lot of 
new discoveries that you have in this episode we also get to see more of how Huey is being impacted by constantly taking this temporary compound V how Butcher's being impacted how it's causing friction amongst our our boys and having Kamiko lose her powers and she's kind of happy about it honestly she doesn't regret this yet she's going to end up regretting it i would imagine um and actually she does later on in the, in the season so if you guys have already seen episode five let me know what you guys thought about it down in the comment section below when this episode airs i do not know i know last week people were like oh my gosh where's episode four because amazon had everyone thinking that episodes would just be dropping early on thursday night when in reality, what they might have just done is, you know, do like a one time thing where they do it for the premiere and then save that Thursday night early release for the finale. Maybe I think they did that with season two. So we'll see if just with the other episodes in between the premiere and the finale, if they're all just going to have to be airing at that 3 a.m. block on the day of. So let me know what y'all thought about episode five. When you get a chance to see it, what are you looking forward to going into episode six? What are you hoping to see in Herogasm? What do you think this is all going to build to? What do you think Soldier Boy has a... Or what do you think some of uh, the other discoveries will be regarding Soldier Boy later on this season? Do you like Soldier Boy so far? Are you liking this arc? Do you like the arcs going on with the boys? Do you like the arc going on with Homelander? Who again, he's just as deranged as ever this season. And I just really like how this season, uh, for for a lot in a lot of ways, it's just overly timely with everything going on outside these outside the doors when you leave your house in this country it's like a, a perfect depiction of all the insanity with superheroes and toxic superheroes that that <laughs> mixed into it so this show continues to be a delight um and i can't wait to see episode six again can't wait for all of you to see episode six because again i think next week is indeed hero gasm but let me know what you guys think about all that down in the comment section below if you haven't already of course make sure you subscribe turn on post notifications you never miss a video in the description i have links to my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there of course let me know any movies news or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video